they're fully harshing her royal buzz. When you marry into the royal family, you marry into centuries worth of tradition. There's protocol to follow and rules to keep in mind, and every move you make is monitored by a slew of palace courtiers. All of this is something Meghan Markle's having to get used to, and apparently she's pretty frustrated with being told no a lot of the time. Meghan hasn't announced her royal patronages yet, but she has major goals and reportedly wants to enact real tangible change, because she's a lovely person. But putting them into action is harder than you'd think. The palace is a magical place, and it is also a place where all you hear is no, 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 a source tells people. The most difficult job in the royal family is to work with Meghan's ambitions and make them realizable. She will get frustrated if she is told, you can't do this or can't do that. Meanwhile, People's Source says Meghan's aides might not be used to the say it as you see it American mentality. Like, cool, but tbh if Meghan wants to use her platform to change the world for the better, the palace best get on board. According to a Daily Mail source, a reconciliation is completely off the table at the moment. There's no chance right now he's been a complete embarrassment. The source also noted Meghan and her estranged father have had issues since before she started dating Prince Harry, and Meghan is reportedly taking this all with a grain of salt, but surely his blabbing isn't helping anything. And as for what the royal family thinks, will they don't think about Thomas at all? They might as well be like Mariah Carey and say, we don't know him. The royal family isn't as upset as you'd think either, said the source. Nothing any of them, the Markle family, say has any real consequence and they, Meghan and Harry, have more important things to focus on. Well, Thomas, it looks like you might be done in this town. 